everyone. My name is Nishtha and I am from SKV GTB Nagar. This presentation is based on Sikkim and is an art integrated project of chemistry. This project is completely based on teamwork. So let's get started with this beautiful project. India is a resource rich country. Various types of minerals are found here. But what is a mineral? Homogeneous naturally occurring substance with a definable internal structure is called mineral. Minerals are found in varied forms in nature ranging from the hardest diamond to the softest talc. Minerals are usually found in ores. There are various types of minerals such as coal, limestone, dolomite, quartz, etc. But our topic is generally based on Sikkim. So the various types of minerals that are found in Sikkim are coal, quartz, dolomite, limestone, etc. Copper, lead, zinc and silver are found in East Sikkim district. Dolomite and talc are found in West Sikkim district, limestone in North and marble in South. But the most abundant mineral that is found in Sikkim is copper. Electroplating is a technique that is used to purify copper. As we all know that Sikkim is a small, extremely mountainous state in the Indian Himalayas which sharply define an extremely steep watersheds. Although Sikkim is only about 40 miles in width and 70 miles in length, its altitude escalates rapidly from about 300 meter above mean sea level in the south to about 8583 meter along the Himalayan Kanchenjunga range. Sikkim is a small state, but its richness in mineral resources is much more than Delhi. Kishong, Ford, Mangon, Gangtok, Namchi. Rangpo, etc. are some of the most popular places in Sikkim known for their best quality minerals. Mineral resources are the key material basis for socio-economic development. Statistical results show that more than 95% of energy used by mankind, 80% industrial raw materials and 70% raw materials for agricultural production are from mineral resources. But if we compare Delhi and Sikkim, then Delhi is a very developed city, but still it lacks mineral resources. In spite of low accessibility, thick vegetal and soil debris, the state of Sikkim is represented by a number of base metal occurrences. Hence, we can say that Delhi and Sikkim are different in their own way. So this was it for this project. Thank you. Have a good day ahead.